won't believe I'm going to be giving you guys all of my super secret techniques that I use to make tons of cash in my restaurant. You're going to be having so many celebrities and guess what? We have a guest appearance of that secret Dominus guy and I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get him to appear inside of your restaurant. What is going on my pancake squad? Welcome to the channel. Your boy Gaza Plays is here building up a juicy restaurant and I know, I know you guys see some things have been changed inside of here already. That's because I got something amazing to show you guys and we got something special in this video here. So guys get ready for this because this is about to get crazy. I'm going to show you guys how you can make millions inside of my restaurant. Like listen, it is so easy. You guys Guys just won't believe it. I'm gonna show you all the techniques and all of the brand new things that they've added which will improve the techniques that we currently have inside of the game so what we're gonna do right now we are actually going to build a brand new place downstairs so as you guys can see I actually cleared up a bunch of things down here so yeah we got a fan up in here big shout out to Lehemo I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that the wrong way but big shout out to you and uh, he's talking about pancake seminars so of stuff but guys we're going ahead to the shop like i said we're going to make something amazing now guys let me show you something right off the back if you guys want to make tons of cash you all need to take advantage of the brand new thing that they brought into the game um and that is sell items now if you have some old things that you don't need inside of the game you can make some extra cash it's not going to be tons but instead of you actually deleting these things and you know you don't have anything to do with them once you upgrade for example when i had the very noobish stove here the crap stove um i know it's a cheap stove but we call it the crap stove because it is trash um i could actually take those and sell those because look at my inventory guys look at my I, I, i'm so such a noob guys i'm be clicking on the stuff right here to go in my inventory but let's look at our appliances and i have 44 of these crap stoves so we definitely need to sell these so this is the first technique that you guys need to take advantage of and these cost 30 guys now i don't know the percentage because your boy is quite dumb in maths honestly so yeah we only getting 30 and we bought it for 100 150 but that's better than getting nothing guys because yeah that's just extra cash now this it won't be a big difference but guys it's better than nothing now one thing oh there we go okay so we're gonna earn 1320 cash from this guy so yeah that's that's money you gotta make the money for wherever you can so we're gonna sell those so that is the first way that is the first technique like like i said you're not gonna get a lot from that but at least you're gonna get something it's better than nothing guys so now the next thing you guys want to take advantage of you gotta spend money guys let me just say this you have to spend money to make money guys so let me show you all this there is something that they just brought and that is the jewelry case increases your chances of getting a celebrity customer and it stacks guys it stacks so for example if the multiplier was times two if you were to get a chance of a percentage of plus plus two or whatever um and if you get a next one of these it will be plus four guys so it will stack so you need to buy yourself tons of these and that's what i'm going to do right now and if you guys do not know what these celebrities do when they come into your restaurant guys they will bring in a horde of brand new customers so you definitely want to bring this in so they're going to be bringing in a ton of people with you so we're going to be buying a few of these right now since we got tons of cash we're going to buy tons 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 because the more people the better guys so yeah we got a lot of those right there so you want to stock up on those because you want to kind of put them on each floor that you have or i mean you don't really have to put them on each floor regardless of where they're at um they're gonna bring in those customers but i'm gonna put them on each floor because there might be something that i've missed out in terms of the tricks now another thing which is very costly guys let me show you all this right now is this pyramid guys the shrine 
um it costs a lot it costs 10 million but when you have this inside of your restaurant guys there's a chance for you to get the mysterious guy everybody be looking for that the question mark guy um the dominus guy whatever nickname you want to give him once you have this there's a chance of you getting him once i activated this inside of my place i was able to get him just like that easy so yeah you definitely want to check that out now the other thing is the royal bundle guys now you can either spend the in-game currency or you can actually spend your current robux if you want to spend all of your robux like that you can actually get the royal bundle and if you have the table guys it has a 10 percent chance to attract a vip customer with any connected chairs when you use with a royal chair this goes up to 100 percent so if i was to buy this royal bundle which i'm going to do in this video guys i don't have enough cash in game currency but i have enough robux but we need to get this for something so you guys can actually see how that goes so y'all know the vip customers they give you tons and tons and tons of cash so you definitely want to you know get these dudes going inside of your restaurant because yeah you're gonna be getting a lot of cash from them and plus they tip and one thing that i missed out about this shrine guys you're gonna be getting tons of money um just the dominus guy alone the dominus guy alone gives you fifty thousand dollars so that's a massive upgrade from selling and listen you could make tons of cash from selling by the way tons of cash i mean i only made one thousand something uh, from that right there when i sold those so imagine the other things that you don't use anymore you're gonna be able to rack up tons of cash like that and like i said the shrine he gives you fifty thousand, and he also brings in ghost customers so you earn thousands of dollars from that dude right there so make sure make sure guys you can get this um if you can afford it so now moving on let me show you guys stuff when you build in your restaurant guys um it would be a great thing if you actually were able to get some tip jars um, if you can't afford tip jars that's totally fine um but it's definitely helpful just a bit so you can earn some cash now if you guys want to get some tip jars for free i always do giveaways on my channel guys when i'm doing my live streams and inside of my brand new discord server which i'll be announcing very soon my brand new discord server we're going to be having daily robux giveaways if you guys want to get some of those juicy stuff like that i gave away a game pass on my live stream the vip game pass i mean i literally just gave the dude the 400 robux or whatever the amount was and also you want to take advantage of these daily deals if you're a vip of course these have big discounts as you can see, this is 25% off. So there's 160,000. I just bought a few of these because we're gonna be needing those for an awesome video for my restaurant and this costs 200,000. So take advantage whenever there are brand new things, you wanna stock up on the best things when they you know get their discounts. So that's that. Then you want to purchase yourself some of these. You need to get some carpets guys whatever you need to get those you need to get the tiles you need to get those because they will help you um bring more customers in because if you have your place um boring people wouldn't want to visit so you definitely need tiles now you need tons of tables you need tons of chairs that's straightforward but you need the decorations as well um more decorations you know the more people that you can bring inside of your restaurant so let's move on to my actual restaurant so i can show you guys my techniques so when you are building so we're going to use this place down here to actually be an example so we're actually going to build something brand new down here so what we're going to do right now i'm going to take one of my golden chip jars and we're going to place it at the door so i'm just going to rotate these you know just so it looks fancy so we put two of them there so that's that's simple stuff um like i said if you have them you can do what i'm doing if you don't have them then you don't have to do it so what i'm gonna actually do like i said these actually stuck um no, i don't want to put that so let's go to decor right now i think it is in decor this is the first time i'm actually buying these but watch this so we're going to take the jewelry case um you can place these anywhere you want um but i'm going to take these and put these in every corner um let's delete this one right here um this stove 
I'm gonna put these in every corner. Like I said, these stock, guys. These actually stock. So you have a chance to bring in some celebrities. I already served a few celebrities, not plenty, but I served, how much celebrities that I've served? I served eight celebrities and that's without these casings. So imagine if I actually have these casings inside of here. But we wanna make in here look pretty fancy, guys. Y'all know that's my style. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna actually take some of these. Since this is the basic area, I'm just gonna come with the basic things here. So we're gonna use the normal chairs that you guys are used to seeing um, on people's first floor. Um, we're gonna build that. Uh, let's do that. So guys, when you're building, you wanna make sure that you are placing four chairs at a table, guys. This is the best technique. Let me tell you why, guys. If you just have four tables like that, you can kind of trick the game system. You can trick the system, guys, to bring four people in at once, like how that happened just now. Um, but if you have solo tables, I mean, is there still a chance of there being one person or three people, but yeah, you get a higher chance of getting more people in or four people at a table if you have it set so that you have four tables at a time. So that is what we're shooting for right now, guys. So we're gonna take this table, not table, we can take this chair, and you wanna kinda have some spacing in between them, um, just so it kinda looks good. Um, but if you're about the money, um, you don't need to put in any spacing. Uh, I mean, this is a money video, of course. Um, but like I said, if you really, really wanted to, if you wanna make money and you want it to look good, you would definitely wanna put in the spacing. Now, you wanna take advantage of every look, every little inch if you see that you're not worried about how the place looks um, but I'm definitely worried about how it looks just a little bit um, I never used to be um, but I'm gonna take advantage of how it, it looks you know I, I like it see the VIP customer right there he be looking nice and handsome just like me you know that's how we do it all right so let's go here we're gonna place that here and we're gonna place that here and we're gonna place that here uh so so far so good we haven't gotten any of those guys come in yet no celebrities so what we're gonna do right now let's test this out guys let's test this out let's put in tons of these right now so you guys could kind of see um if these actually work so we're gonna test out the theory right now we're gonna put tons of these jewelry stands and let's see if we can get in some celebrities inside of this place so we're gonna place them place them place them while we build um we got tons of these so yeah we're definitely just gonna place these down like that that all right so so far so we didn't we're not getting anything so far um we just need to wait and see all right so let's continue to build we want to put down the money tree i want to put down my money tree this is another way that you can earn money um honestly it's not tons of cash that you earn from the money tree um the money tree is kind of a disappointing thing um but yeah we still gotta put it down anyways um really didn't like how how it did so just 250 the max i've gone for my money tree one time is four thousand dollars i didn't even know how that worked um but i've never gotten that again i don't know if it was a little bug or something guys but yeah what we're gonna do let's just put down all these things and i oh, see that see someone put in the tip just now guys so i was getting some money from that all right so you definitely want to take advantage of the tip just uh let's do that um, we don't want it running in, so we're definitely going to have to take advantage of some of this space. So, here's what we're going to do. Uh, we definitely let, need to let this touch. All right, there we go. There we go. Um, there we go. Oops. I've I been placing it so bad, guys. I've been placing it so bad. So, so far, so good. Honestly, let me tell you guys the truth. I wasn't a massive fan of this game at the very beginning but i just started to really like it after a while guys like honestly it started to be so much fun um i've never played the tycoon um game that people always say this is like never played it before but yeah if it was like this i sort of uh, i probably would have been playing this game honestly just because of how fun this one actually is there are tons of videos that i have here you like my place thank you this dude says he loves my place guys so what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna continue to build. Come on guys, we're gonna continue to build. It's looking nice and juicy so far. Uh, let's take this 
and we put it here, put it here, put it here, take it, put it here. We need to leave some space to be able to put down the counters and stuff though. We have to leave that space. Um, that is too close, so we definitely need to take advantage of that. Um, that, that, and that. I know it looks weird right here, guys, but we definitely have to do it like this. All right, so let's go. Be putting it down. This is for the video, guys. We got, oh my gosh. Why do I suck at placing down these things, guys? I I honestly suck at doing this. Um, let's go. I suck at doing this, guys. I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Look at me speaking a different language. I am not the best builder, honestly, but I can definitely give you tons of tips and trips. All right. I, I know I said trips, guys. Don't worry. It, it, it's just me, guys. It's just me. It's just your boy, guys. And that's how your boys speak. I am from a different planet, guys. Don't forget that. All right, so let's put that one here and put that here. So far, so good. I, I know you guys are enjoying this. Look at this dude. He's so amazing. He's like, oh my gosh, I wish I was rich like this dude. He's he's uh, he's envying me guys. He's uh, I'll be the envy of all of my friends guys. Oh my gosh. There we go Let's go. Let's put that there. Let's put that there. Let's put that there and let's place that table Oh my gosh, so much people are gonna be coming inside of my restaurant. Let's go. There we go Hey, hey, bro. Hey, you in the way you in the way dude i'm so sorry he's just looking at how gorgeous my place is he's like bro i wish i was like this dude all right so because the last time when y'all saw this yeah there it, it was just a mess there was just a bunch of stoves and all sorts of weird things going on in here um but it's definitely not like that anymore bro this place is crowded we definitely have to leave that space at the door though um yeah we don't want to overdo it so now what we're gonna do right now guys we need to place down some appliances um the order stand and stuff bro i think we might have came a bit too close we might have came a bit too close i think i want to move this table so people can actually come and order so let's move that table and we're gonna put down some decor right now guys um let's go oops not yeah I, I said decor and I'm at the other place. I'm at appliances or whatever. Um, so let's go put down that piece of red carpet right there. And what we're gonna do, like I said, we need to place down this appliance. Uh, place that like that. That's our order stand. We're definitely gonna need that. Um, yeah, some of these things definitely gonna have to move. I think I have to move this whole row actually. I have to move this whole row guys. Oh my gosh what a massive setback but watch what i'm going to do though it's not going to be that great of a setback um let's take that let's take that um let's move this let's move that let's move that so now here is what we're going to do that is at the center i believe i i think that is at the center i think i would need to put one more let's put one more order stand um to make that look even better all right so now that the order stands are there we got our money tree going on over there and um, we need to put a table over here this dude is just looking oh bro i was gonna put an order stand there as a table jeez guys oh, come on such a noob such a big noob so let's go we need to put down this next decor there and i think i need to go get some stuff i don't have enough of these oh i do have oh i definitely don't have bro look at all these people coming in tons of people are coming in so let's get inside of here we need to buy some of these things quick let's see if any of those are on sale and uh, nah, none of them are on sale but we need to get these these are cheap though these are cheap i don't need tons of those there we go just a few just a few just a few all right there we go now let's get back to where we need to go so let's do this let's do this you see i'm getting those tips right guys this is the best restaurant in my restaurant guys this place right here is the best looking restaurant I, I'm, I'm i'm just kidding guys I, I don't want you guys to destroy me be like guys so your place looks like trash i don't want you guys to do that to me that will hurt my feelings greatly so yeah I, i'm gonna be quiet all right so that's how it be looking it looking nice and juicy down here um we got tons of stoves tons of things going on so let's do that let's do that um i think i want to place these casings around the whole place bro we got so much things going on here like it's pretty insane we need to get ourselves some dishwashers though um let's check 
Um, we don't have any. Yeah, we got a high tech dishwasher, bro. High tech. You know, that's the way we move. Um, I think I need to get one more high tech dishwasher and we will be nice and juicy. Um, so that's that. That's that. All right, we got two stoves over there, two stoves over there. Um, we need to delete this one. Um, we're gonna fill that out with dishwashers. Um, so let's take this one. We're gonna put it here. Um, how much dishwashers can go in here? All right, that's one. Let's take that. We need to buy, what, three more? Is that three more? Yeah, I think it's three more of those we need to buy. So you just need to buy one set. And my people are so happy. Look at that money just flying up. All right, we need to get the high-tech dishwasher. Um, let's buy that three. Easy money right there, guys. Easy money. We're gonna make that money back so fast, especially after we're... Look at all those people. Look at all those people. Watch what I'm gonna do, guys. Like, is this the high-tech? Oh, okay. So what the hell is this? What, what dishwasher is this? high-tech dishwasher why does it look like this is this a stove that i bought is this a stove that i bought guys if, if this is a stove that i bought i will be so angry i bought a high-tech stove why didn't you guys tell me that's what i bought oh my gosh i am such a noob i bought a high-tech stove oh my gosh you're supposed to be buying a high-tech dishwasher we literally wasted money guys oh my gosh but nothing is being wasted in here guys we, we gonna use everything regardless so let's take down our high-tech dishwasher let's put that down actually we only need two of them hey why why are you jumping on these high-tech stoves like that bro you only need two of these high-tech dishwashers down here um i keep putting down the high-tech stoves guys why am i doing that high-tech dishwasher there we go two high-tech dishwashers and we'll just take um what we're gonna do now what we're gonna do now we're gonna get some of these stainless steel nah they're trash they're trash we need to get the high-tech stove let's put the high-tech stove there one high-tech stove there one high-tech stove there make it look even even like steven so there we go now what we're gonna do now we're gonna finish fill out this place um let's do this let's put the jewelry case in here jewelry case in there oh my gosh we're gonna have so many people inside of here this place is gonna be filled filled with those type of customers he's just looking he's like oh my gosh gosh he's so rich i wish i was like him that's what he's saying right now we actually need to move some stuff All right, guys, we need to move some things over inside of my restaurant right now. I need to give this person their food. I don't even know how I get serving these dudes. And this place up here definitely needs to be revamped as well. Um, bro, we getting tons of cash, bro. We getting tons of cash. Look at all of these people just hopping inside of here, guys. Like, it's so insane. But we definitely need to move the table over. Oh, my gosh. This is going to be bad. These people aren't going to like me after this, but I have to do this, guys. I have to do this. Oh, no. I only have to move it over once here. Should I do it like that? Or I have to move the whole table over? Um, Because I need to put in the jewelry cases here. We need to fill out this whole place with jewelry cases. Um, We need to fill it up. I'm going to do this in every one of those places, guys. So jewelry case there. And like they said, this stuff stocks, guys. This stuff stacks. So I think I'm going to be moving this um, one over. This whole table one over. Uh, let's move the tree. Oh, I don't have to move the table. I think I could just move the tree. Yeah, I only need to move the tree. All right. But I still need to move these guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going to lose some money from this. Oh, I'm sorry, man. Dang. We're going to lose that money, but we have to do this, guys. We need to move this table over. Um yeah i think i'm just gonna leave that walk oh my gosh i could have just leave this walkway empty that's what i could have done i'm so oh let me let these dudes eat i think i'm gonna nah, I'm, I'm not i'm not letting y'all eat get out my way bro get out my way all right so we're gonna do put the last jewelry case there and i think we're just gonna leave that way clear guys honestly um so what we're gonna do we're gonna take this uh let's go to our furniture and we're gonna take some tables 
one table. I say in tables. And we're gonna take the chair. We're gonna put that here, put that here, put this here, put this here. And that is it. So people could actually come in and they could walk around. There we go. That is how we want our restaurant to be. I can actually add in a second row here um, because it won't be that much, honestly. And we could take this and put that there. And yeah, it will just be a double table, a double, not double table, but you know, two people can actually sit here and um, there we go and let's do it like that you don't want to do it like how I'm doing it right here in terms of the table um guys you want to have four people at a table but just because this is my design of how I'm doing things that's why I'm doing it like that look at all of the jewelry cases that we have in here and all you could see is a bunch of tips guys I'm getting so many tips it is insane that's why, look at that, just tips guys, tips all day. All right, so yeah, let me collect my money tree. Uh, you know, we gotta collect that bad boy. So that is it right here, guys. You can get tons of cash from that. So what we're gonna do right now, like I said, I was going to buy the royal thing, but I just realized I'm going to actually be saving that. Look how much money we're getting. I'm gonna be saving that for another video, guys. I'm gonna save that for another video, but before we actually end up this video, we got something insane to do. We gotta do this, guys. We about to summon it. There we go. There is a chance. It, oh my gosh, it's an earthquake. It is an earthquake. Get under the table, guys. Get under the table. Bro, that is so insane. Oh my gosh. Bro, that earthquake, it be shaking so much. That there has to be a mysterious presence. Let's go. There's a mysterious presence in our restaurant, guys. And I'm going to show you. This is the final way you can make tons of cash. Hopefully, the ghost guy comes inside of our restaurant. Um, It's not guaranteed, by the way. It is not guaranteed. But you will have to wait and see if he actually appears inside of here. Because if he appears, that will be very very insane so hopefully he appears inside of here and we'll get to the part if he actually appears inside of the rest oh my gosh guys oh my gosh the ghost guy is here oh my gosh the dominus man is here and he is alive oh my gosh look at oh my gosh look at all the people that are inside of my restaurant guys look at them oh my gosh take a look at this handsome guy look at him look at him go i'm sure he's going to the top floor that's where it's the most fancy he has to be up here there we go look at all the ghost people having us having a seat and eating all the juicy food he didn't go here this time wow he didn't want to eat fancy this time guys so we're actually going to try to find him let's go to floor seven um i don't know why he would be on floor seven because i kind of don't even like floor seven myself now let's go to floor six. Would he be in floor six? Bro, where is this dude? He has to be on floor five. There he is. He is here on floor five. Him and his brethren. What's up, Timmy? What's up, Tommy? What's up, Sam? And what's up, Kimmy? Have you decided what you want to eat yet, sir? Have you decided? You can see on his facial expression that he hasn't decided as yet. You can see that there's just a bunch of question marks, guys. That means he, yeah, he don't even know what he wants. Um, um, hey, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm here for you. I'm here for you if you, if you need anything, okay? If you need anything, I'm, I'm here. Look at all the money. Look at the money just going up so fast, guys. Look at it. It's just going up. We're just making so much money right now. So yeah, we definitely need to upgrade tons of things inside of my restaurant. I'm going to be doing that in some videos for you guys. I have an amazing video that is actually coming up. But well, let's see if this dude actually is going to give me... Oh, oh, he already put in his order. Why did you take so long to bring this dude? Oh my gosh, look at him. He's eating a hot dog. And look at his friends. Oh my gosh. This is an exquisite man. Like he, he only eats the best guys. He only eats the best. As you can see, hot dog. This is what the rich people eat, guys. They only eat hot dog. So I need to start eating hot dogs so I can feel like I'm rich, bro. I, I, I can't afford to be buying too many hot dogs. So come on, bro. Oh my gosh. I, I, I must sit next to this dude. Like I feel like a first class man right now, guys. I feel so good. 
He's just eating all my juicy food. Okay, I, I, I have to pick up this dude's plate. Like, he'll give tons of money um, if I do this, I'm guessing. So let's put that thing up. Let's see what the Dominus guy is going. He left money. He left money, guys. He left money. Oh my gosh, he left some money. Let's watch him and see if he actually tips. Let's take a look. Oh my gosh, we got so much money since he came inside here. We literally got that fifty thousand dollars. We're going to floor one. Let's hurry up, go. And celebrities are inside. If you're pro, everyone is coming in one time. Look at all the money that we're going to be making, bro. Let's see if he's going to drop a tip. I don't even see him. Where is he? Did he go? Oh, there he is. Come on, drop a tip for us, bro. Drop a tip for us. Come on, come on, drop a tip. Drop a tip. Are you going to drop a tip? Did he drop a tip? I don't know if he dropped a tip. I think he dropped a tip, but yeah, he just disappeared. Oh my gosh, that is so insane, guys. But as you guys can see, we're making tons of cash. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. This was pretty insane. We got celebrities. We got the ghost guy coming in. Like, it just was insane, guys. It just really was insane. But thank you guys for watching this video. Hopefully you all enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.